<laughs> I didn't know many, so many people wanted their butt to feel so warm. Not in a sexual way. Let's go ahead. Hello there everyone, I'm Clown Nebel and welcome to Either, a game of preferences, better known as uh, Would You Rather. This is not the usual kind of game that I play for you guys, but today I want to do something different. I want to get to, to know each, each other better. Now, both yourselves, if you want to give me some feedback on the comments for the choices I will make, and also on myself. Mm, I will show you today what's going on, it's my psycho mad mind. I would really like to do to know that as well, that could be cool. So let's go. Probably you're already seeing some YouTubers doing this game. It's about, uh, you have a question, a choice, and you have to choose which one is the uh, one that suits you better. And so let's see how many psycho and wrong decisions I will make. So let's start then. Uh, would you rather live in a tree house or live in a floating boat house? Um, Try the tree house is cool, but uh, you know, it's always in the same place. You know, more, more the people are disagreeing, I will go with a floating boat house. Okay, these have been already cho chosen. So here we go, let's move to the next one. Would you rather always be naked, always be itchy? I hate being itchy. Also, being naked uh, could be a good thing. I like being naked. Not in front of people, of course. Um, but uh, I wonder if, like in winter, that could be very uncomfortable. Being, uh, always have mandatory no clothes on. That could be a thing. As well, I could live in the Bahamas or maybe in a, in a way. And that could be a thing too. So I, I prefer be naked. Maybe I can go out only in summer. That could be cool. The rest of the time I can masturbate and uh, play games naked on my chair. Let's go with it. And more people agree with me, of course. <laughs> Who wants to be itchy all the time? Would you rather be caught at home watching Sex and the City by yourself, or be caught in a bar with a pink martini in hand? Hmm. Okay, I never watched Sex and the City. Pink martini, I don't know, it's... <laughs> yeah, it's supposed to be, oh, you're so gay, but, you know, being gay is not, like, that offensive. I'm straight, but uh, I don't care. I mean, I don't consider being called gay as an insult. Even it's in a, Italy, usually this is sort of referenced as an insult, called someone gay. So, you know, being caught in a bar with a pink martini in hand, that could be like the, uh, the cool guy with the, you know, the noble taste for alcohol. So let's go with pink martini. And more people agree with me. Also, if I'm staying in a bar with a, a cocktail, I'm probably surrounded by friends or hot chicks. Because chicks like pink martini. Move on, on! Would you rather never again play a game on your computer, never again play a console portable device game? <laughs> Easy, no-brainer. I mean, never again, play, never again play a console portable device game. I mean, we know that the best games are on the computer. There's no kidding among us. Sorry, console gamers, but uh, this is what it is. I mean, there's like much more free to play games, much more indie games. It's easy to start a channel and uh, do YouTube also. It is cool too. Commentary. And uh, there is like 99% of the games that comes out, comes out for the PC. Sometimes, like Batman, Batman Arkham Knight, they come. They're not very good for the PC, like ported from consoles, but you know, you have so much more to play than that. So never again play a console. And, okay... Wow! I didn't know many people were for the console side. Okay, let's move on then. Would you rather toilet paper a house, egg a house? Hmm... <laughs> uh, this is like when the Halloween comes around, you do trick or treat and then... You do like this. I know, I never did actually trick someone with Halloween. I, I, I've been around asking for candies, but I never do the trick there. I I don't know. Egg House could be a, a little bit more annoying. I mean, especially if you think about it. You have to scratch all over the, your windows. You have to clean up all your roof and stuff. So I'd rather uh, put toilet paper a house. Even though it could catch fire more easily and burn the house. Uh, okay, let's go. <laughs> uh, let's go egg then. 
50 by 56% people. I see. Uh, okay, I'm getting more on the mainstream side. I'm not such a hipster. Would you rather sit on a cold toilet seat? Sit on a warm toilet seat? Hmm, this one is kinda easy. A cold toilet seat I could, uh, like, uh, warm it up with my body heat, but a war already warm toilet seat, like, would be boiling, so I go cold toilet seat. And yeah, wow, th this is very close. <laughs> I didn't know many, so many people wanted their butt to feel so warm. Not in a sexual way. Let's go ahead. Would you rather run someone over, be run over? Hmm. I'd rather be run over. I don't want to kill anyone while driving. Oh, okay. All right, people are very much selfish, I believe. I wouldn't, <laughs> I wouldn't like being run over either. But I mean, it's better than run over someone, especially if you have a big car. Would you rather be a? Oh, would you rather? <clears throat> Morning person, night owl. Hmm. I'm usually a night owl because I spin, I go to sleep very very late. I would rather, I would like to be more a, mer a morning person, but you know, in the night uh, I prefer staying awake in the night because it's all calm, it's quiet. I like to watch videos or even writing. I like uh, to write some tales because I do that sometimes. If I manage to pull me in the chair and start writing something, I I'm more likely of a night owl. Yeah, and people agree with me, because Night Owls are cool, just like Venus. <laughs> Gaming. Would you rather be married to someone who is... I know it all, very ignorant. Okay, so I believe there are ignorant and smart people, but you know, it's not that really what matters. I mean, you can be funny and uh, lovely if you, if you, if you are both of them. I know it all, maybe it could be like the guy, oh, I know better this, or I, I do better that. So it's like completely annoying, very ignorant, you can talk about uh, uh, many stuff. Very ignorant, you, you know, you, you can learn something as well. I know it all can't learn anything, that's uh, what they makes them so annoying. They don't want to learn anything more. Uh, okay, let's go with very ignorant. Okay. Uh, I don't know. Could be uh, mm, something we can discuss about it. I don't know. I'm not. Also, I'm not the one that's here. Oh, I will teach. I will teach them all I know, and they will be like a perfect person for me. And that's not. It's not like that. I mean, a very ignorant person can be very, very smart if you like lead the way, like read some books, do something. I know it all. It's not very much of a people you can build something with. I believe. Of course you can, if you find someone like this, but it's harder. Okay, would you rather be malnourished, be obese? <laughs> so many good choices here. Okay, I've been, I've passed already the fat phase of my life. I waited my mm, most amount of weight was like about 105 kilos or something. And then I went uh, back to, I don't know, 70 or 60 even. I went uh, like uh, underweight for some time, but now I'm fine. I'd, be, I'd rather be malnourished. I think there are less problems with that. Okay, and people agree with me. You can always eat. It's also, this is a reason you can eat more with that. I mean, you're malnourished, you have to eat. Let's go ahead. When you go to bed at night, would you rather have a drenched elf power a bucket of water on you every 15 minutes? <laughs> These are the crazy sexual... <clears throat> Fetishism of some like very very strange people here in quote Buffalo Soldier quote by Bob Marley play at uh, 100 decibels for three minutes at a time at random intervals Hmm Okay, I believe this is a pretty high volume for that Maybe I, I like more the water on my face I, also when you, it's like it's very hot it could be a, like a very cool thing, you know, in summer, having someone that throw at you water could be like uh, the blessing from the sky. And, you know, people disagree with me. Okay. I think they are really, really much Bob Marley's lover, I think. I'm more on the Santa side. 
Would you rather be disemboweled by a Japanese sushi chef, chef and served on a platter to Justin Bieber? Okay, doesn't matter who I'm served to, I believe. Run through a pride of starving lions wearing Lady Gaga's mid-dress. Disemboweled means like... Okay, disemboweled means that they took your guts out, I think. So I guess I will go with the... <laughs> the thing that has more chance of survival, run through a pride of starving lions. Even though it could be more riskful. I mean, you can succeed, you can be alive, but uh, it could be very a much worse death, I believe. Let's go with that. And yeah, 70% of people, of course. <laughs> we'll go for that little chance of surviving. <laughs> well, why not, I mean. Would you rather? Dress like people would uh, hundreds of years ago. Dress like a person from the future. I'm more a vintage guy, I mean, it could be cool dressing uh, from a person from the future, but seeing how aliens are pictured in movies and that we will be naked, that could be also a, thi a cool thing to do. But I'd rather be like uh, one of the 18th, 19th century old gentlemen of London, like a steampunk style, that could be cool. Also a caveman, <laughs> that would be nice. Oh, people disagree with me. Okay, I believe there are not many vintage lovers here. The, now the, the hipsters are more on this side. Okay, moving on. If you go back in time and sign the Declaration of Independence, which is not the one of my country, but okay, I'll pretend to be American, would you rather sign your real name, sign using a ridiculous pseudonym? <laughs> Wiener Microch. <laughs> that could be something really, really tempting. <clears throat> <laughs> that could be cool. Like, uh, I don't know. I don't many. I don't know many word joke word word jokes. Uh, I'd rather sign your real name. You know, be uh, remembered throughout history. But also, this could be a cool thing to do. This is a very close one. Oh, yeah. I thought that could be very 50-50 or even more people doing that pseudonym. In, pseudonym. Then, would you rather reach your ideal salary, reach your ideal weight? I'm, I'm quite stable, so I guess I will go with the ideal salary. Also, the ideal salary helps you a lot, <laughs> gaining, I mean, reaching your your uh, ideal weight. You know, you don't have to worry about much stuffing, because you can go to gym. Would you rather only Brutal Metal, only Justin Bieber? <laughs> Do I even have to think about it? <laughs> only Brutal Metal. I mean... Mermaider, Mermaider! Be known as, all, as the all-time greatest, would you rather? Mathematician, writer. Writer, no-brainer, also. Writer, yeah. I also like writing. I want to... I would like to publish a, a tale of mine sometime. I need to force me to do this someday. Then, going on. Would you rather live in Africa for a year, live in Antarctica for a year? As much as I would like to go in Africa, I... you know, Antarctica is kind of interesting, you know, it's cold, but I really, really like the, the panorama, more the the, uh, the, the setting, uh, you know, I, I'd rather be living in Antarctica for you, it could be cool, unless it's some f sort of like the thing of camper, Carpenter in which there are uh, monsters that uh, clone us humans in some way, and uh, like uh, get uh, their their aspects, their features, and started to kill each other. That could be a thing that could limit to go to Africa. But uh, overall, I would like to see Antarctica more. And people disagree. Yeah, I mean it's not a very lonely place, I believe. But if you go with some dudes, you can chill. You can have boozes. No one thinks you about uh, you wrong. There's also there are not lions chasing you after all, <laughs> while you're dressed with uh, Lady Gaga's meat dress. Okay, so guys, at this point, uh, do you agree with the choices I made? I mean, I would like to know your answers, some sort of your opinions in the comments. It would be very, very cool to start a discussion on this. Would you rather have a lightsaber, a real lightsaber, save a random African kid from starvation? Also, this is one is no brainer. After all, I'm not that fan of Star Wars. It could be cool to have a lightsaber, but yeah, saving an African child could be much, much better. And people disagree. Oh, you Star Wars nerds. Would you rather be a carrot, be a cucumber? <laughs> if I were a cucumber, I, probably at some point I would be in some other's vagina or butt. Be a carrot is uh, rather 
uh, harder to go in that places, but also it's easier to be eaten by <laughs> rabbits. That could be a horrible death. So being sticked in a in an asshole or in a <laughs> vagina that that wouldn't be very much much worse unless you have some more time to 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 be alive. Okay, I slightly disagreed on this one. And I mean, it's not pretty much a big deal, the difference. If you were a pirate, would you rather have a pet monkey, have a talking parrot? I mean, do you have? A, do you even have to ask me? Have <laughs> a talking parrot, that is so cool. The monkey is cool, but the parrot that can talk. I mean, this is the, the ideal pirate, the stereotype of the pirate. Must have a talking parrot. That is his entire life. How go? 50 men of the bad chest! Okay, there we go. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah, the monkey also, also is cool, but people do not agree with me on the pirate. Alright. The new, the new style, the hipster pirates has the pet monkey. Would you rather have a house made of sprawling underground rooms and tunnels, have a small flying house? That could be something like Up, the movie. That could be cool, a house filled with balloons that is moving in the air. As I said with um, the tree house or the... Uh, or the how is that the boat house uh, that could be cool because you have a very very large house but nonetheless it's un it's underground there's no light uh, I will go with a small flying house and people disagree again with me now I'm, I'm getting more on the hipster side okay but not that much of a difference here would you rather be the parent of Adolf Hitler be the parent of Osama bin Laden you know I don't like them uh, I I really don't like them, but Osama bin Laden is living uh, like in a harem with dozens of ladies, but uh, is always like escaping, uh, being in the desert like a fugitive. That would be a very good life. Also in the desert, and it's not very cool. And also with the religious stuff, I'm not into religion, so that could be a problem too. Be the parent of Adolf Hitler, or also. Could be worse from a historical point of view, but as, at least I would have like some time to spend my life better, or maybe I could assassinate him eventually. That could be cool. Like be sneaking in his apartment and kill him. So I will go with Alfred Hitler. And yeah, people agree with me. <laughs> I believe many ones are Americans and hate Bin Laden more than Hitler. I would say, <laughs> just like seeing the reactions. On when they dec decapitated him, they were like, "Oh, oh my God! They decapitated Obama Bin Laden! Woohoo!" Because we are civilians. Yeah. Okay. Well then, would you rather talk like Yoda, breathe like Darth Vader? <laughs> it's cool to breathe like Darth Vader. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> that could be very, very funny. I could do also also the best impressionist of Darth Vader. Moving on, would you rather be married to a Jersey Shore outfit? Okay, I'm already saying no. I don't want to see Jersey Shore. The only time I tried to watch it, I was like, mm, like zapping and all. I just went to MTV and it was like, a, I don't know, a, a lady that was like giving blowjobs because she lost a bet or something. So I say, okay, never mind. <clears throat> Moving on. In Winter Olympics, I will probably participate using the snowboard. Uh, that could be cooler. Yeah, we'll go with the Winter Olympics. And everybody prefers the summer. What time is it? Summer time! Everybody has watched High School Musical. Only me has watched like the Russian School Musical. Would you rather eat Nutella, eat bacon? Okay, Nutella is very good, but I'd rather go with bacon. Yeah, more America! America! Let's go ahead. Would you rather explode, implode? Uh, what is the difference? For me, there's no difference at all. But for the people around me, that could be better to implode. Okay, and everybody disagree. Or maybe they, they say, like, implode in the metaphorical sense. is like, uh, on, of your emotions or something. Yeah, that could be also imploding. Also, explode could be a, a good thing for feelings. You know, to show them to other people, but I'm more of an introvert guy. So, if you have like to go with explosives, like TNT, I will go with the implode. Would you rather 80s child star actor, 60s one hit wonder? 
Hmm. Eight, 80s child star actors are not very, very much <laughs> lucky. So I'll go with the 60s one hit wonder. Let's go with the 60s. Okay. You, did you know what happened with the guy that made uh, uh, Anakin Skywalker in the Phantom Mess? You know that. I believe he was born in the 80s. Okay, I'm just saying. Let's go ahead. Would you rather have your name known forever for doing something terrible? Never be recognized for some, a clock ever. Accomplishing something wonderful. Okay, this is sort of cool. You know, doing something terrible. For as much as it can be temptating, I'll go with doing something wonderful without never being recognized. I mean, it, it only matters like to be recognized by the people that you care about. That's what it matters the most. And yeah, people agree with me. Because we are like, or like saviors. Nobody wants to be like a, an explicit Hitler or something. Would you rather have unlimited money but no access to women? Be surrounded by women but be poor. <laughs> Come on, guys. I mean, no brain in also this one. Be surrounded by women. We all prefer that. I mean, <laughs> I mean, <laughs> if you're a heterosexual and all. Rather, would you rather eat all the carpet in your house, eat all the wood and tiles in your house? Wow, tiles, I don't know what that means, but it's part of the structures, I believe. Wood and tiles are, are pretty hard to eat. I will go with carpet, even though I'm allergic to dust and I could die with this. But I believe if you boil the carpet, you do like some sort of scene of Charlie Chaplin in the Gold Fever movie, eating your own shoes. That could be better, your carpet. Yeah, it's easier to chew without dust. Maybe I, I could clean a little bit that. Would you rather only speak in questions, only speak in movie quotes? <laughs> I already speak in movie quotes. No brainer. Yeah, you can do like, you're coming with me. Or maybe... Did you read the Bible recently? Ezekiel 25.17. I already speak like that, so no wonder. Be albino or be a ginger? Well, you know, I would like to have red hair. Also, albino could be cool. Like, having white hair also could be cool. But uh, the albino and ginger, there's not very much compatible with the sun. Uh, maybe I'll go with the ginger. They're more, like, more easy to fit in. Yeah, and everyone here. I would rather be with um, a ginger, like a girlfriend ginger. Ginger girlfriend. So, this is the last one for now. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, please let me know in the comments if you like, uh, you disagree, or agree with the, the choices I made in this game. And let me know in those also if you want to see me more doing this kind of thing. That could be funny. I mean, something different from the usual playing games and all. Uh, so I thank you very much for watching. And feel free also to share and like this video if you enjoyed. And yeah, we will see each other again in the next one I will make. Thank you guys for your support. Uh, always very much obliged to you for what you're doing for the channel and uh, hopefully you'll like what I'm doing I'm planning on doing more stuff cool stuff yeah I know I'm always saying I'm planning to go to do more cool stuff but now it's I have some time uh, not that I have exams to do yeah right and remember if you can sleep the clowns are gonna eat thee would you rather be eaten or be or they cut your legs Give me an answer on that. Good night.